in, let's go back to Commissioner Silver. With the ninth pick in the 2023 NBA Draft, the Utah Jazz select Taylor Hendricks from UCF. Taylor Hendricks, the first ever player out of UCF to be sure. drafted in the first round. And he's actually from Florida. He got offers from Miami from Florida, from Florida State. Ultimately, he blazed his own yeah, path to USC and becoming the first pick out of the program. He, he was in and that when that the one. pick was called, JJ, you said, yes, I love this guy. Why is that? Well, let's start Watch with the defense. He's on the floor on the floor on the gym and her right. He led the conference in blocks while simultaneously shooting over 39% from three on almost five attempts a game. This guy's floor, is the prototypical modern 3 and D guy. His upside is if he becomes better on the ball, but when you talk about the defensive component, the rebounding, the rim protection, yep. plus the catch and shoot ability, he's a phenomenal pick at this spot for the Utah Jazz. Not to mention his ability to stretch Six the floor. Nine, my God. That, that's really the key, and that's what JJ means by the prototypical 3 and D big guy. He's a stretch four. He's primarily a catch and shoot guy like rather than dribbling into his shot but his ability to rebound he plays with a high motor he really plays hard and he's got well, the versatility on the defensive end he can well, switch no out sword. he sees the ball well he's been very well coached no he played for uh, johnny dawkins at ucf who was the number 10 pick of the san antonio spurs in mm, 1986 close. and maybe the most important player in duke basketball Ooh. history uh, but he, he i think he's a terrific player and, and to jj's point like his floor is set and it's just a question of how high his ceiling is. But you combine him with Walker Kessler and protecting the rim as a four, that's pretty impressive. I, I know three and D is a thing. I'm going to add a T at the end because he scored just under one and a half points in transition. The T is for transition. Three, D, and T. We're just going to create a new phrase.